On the day today tonight, MP in heartless outburst after a bomb goes off in Herd's bath. Well, one bomb's going off in the Foreign Secretary's hand, but all he does is say, well, I didn't need that hand anyway. And a warm handshake from Michael Heseltine for the children he is about to release into the woods and shoot. How do you do? Nice to say hello to you. The Bank of England is in chaos following the discovery that the pound has been stolen. As the news broke, trading rooms were plunged into chaos. Even seasoned campaigners, known for grace under pressure, reduced to squawking the day's panicked cry. What's happening? What's happening? The pound was stolen at 1.30 this afternoon by thieves dressed as cleaners. They drove a white Montego. Helicopter police gave chase, but despite the shunt, the men escaped, making good with their legs across open ground. As city markets crashed and flew off, the government tried to stabilize the economy with an emergency currency based on the Queen's eggs, several thousand of which were removed from her ovaries in 1953 and held in reserve. This meant anyone mad enough to seize on the panic selling of dead pounds could become a dollar millionaire in less than an hour. How much money have you personally made today? Uh, probably about 10 million. Wow. Throughout the day, bank officials have refused to confirm the rumours that the pound was only vulnerable at all because they removed it to play with at lunchtime and forgot to put it back. Later tonight, we'll be asking Malcolm Rifkin for his view and asking him why he likes pulling the legs off live dogs and shooting foreign policemen.